Yahoo, 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 and welcome back to my channel, everyone. I am Mr. Super Ginky, and something significant happened in my life today. I got a job. Boom, 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 bing, 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 bing. What does that mean? What kind of job did I get? Who knows? I know because I planned it out. You see, back when the COOF pandemic hit the world, I was in Europe and I was an English teacher, right? But it made me think about my life because I wanted to be for in Europe for two years, right? I wanted to spend some extra time there. But then when the COOF pandemic hit, I was like, dude, man, do I really want to be in Europe for two years? I don't know, man. I kind of want to see my family. I kind of want to go back to America. I want to rebuild myself, plan the next step in my life. But I got to think about this because I've been living the past seven years of my life on auto repeat. Every single year, I've been taking the same step. It's always go abroad, come back home, plan to go abroad again, come back home, plan to go abroad again. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bum. They always repeat themselves. And the problem with this, there's no, there's not really a problem. There's an issue. The issue is that I've never been consistent or disciplined with gaining technical knowledge and discipline in creating content. And that's what I really want to do. I want to create some heartfelt content for all of you to view and to take some perspective from because this life is so much longer than we think it is and the world is so much bigger there are so many things and possibilities at our fingertips literally but what we have to learn how to do is to use them efficiently right so when i was abroad i was like i'm gonna come back but i'm, I'm gonna need some kind of job right because i've never had a job in america it's funny to think that this is the first job i've ever had in america so i'm gonna come back to america what am i gonna do what do i want to do how do i want to live these were all the questions that i asked myself and i reached a conclusion that i want to be a server i want to see the restaurant industry because my father keeps telling me stories about how hard it is to work in that industry and when I got back to America, I wasn't really hype on the job kind of thing. I was like, yeah, I just want to keep doing it myself, man. I'll, I'll figure out where I'm going to go next time because like, I'm going to go join the Navy next year anyway. So like, I'll just take this time to myself. No, 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 no. That was me wanting to take the same step again. And these are the conversations that we have with ourselves most often that lead us to repeat the same mistakes in the year to come. Like, I can't believe it, man. Like the same months I have girlfriends, the same months I make the same mistakes, the same months I do the same things because I'm a seasonal kind of creature, man. I swear it's always like winter, I'm breaking. Fall, I'm hopeful. Spring, I'm broken. Summer, I'm rebuilding. Auto repeat, auto repeat, auto repeat. We gotta break the cycle so that we can continue to make meaningful progress moving forward in our lives. So now I got a job as a hostess at a restaurant. I'm gonna give some homage to my parents because they definitely helped open the door for me. And the timing was great too because Miami just let restaurants open up the inside again. But I really think it's important because I've been around the world and in Japan, all the young kids want to work. Um, in Europe, none of the young kids want to work. In America, I don't know. But I just know that this COOF pandemic has definitely affected everyone in the workforce. But no matter where I've gone, people have always told me, man, you're here to do a job. You need to learn how to work in different stories, in different countries, different continents. They've always said this to me, but I was never that person that wanted to do this because I'm like teeter tottering on like the, I don't want to work and I do want to work. It really depends because I have other things that I want to do. I have other creations that I want to do. But this is the issue because I've had a large amount of free time. I don't think free time necessarily creates urgency. I don't think free time necessarily creates the desire to want to work on your goals and your dreams, maybe for a little bit, but then eventually you're going to see how hard it is. And you're just going to be like, nah, man, I don't want to do this anymore. I just want to take a chill pill. I just want to relax. And that happens one day, two day, three day, and it spirals out of control. This has happened to me so many times along the journey but i have a job in america now this is the first time i've ever had a restaurant job the first time i've ever had a job in america this is the semblance of a new step in my journey because what i'm doing is and i'm still going abroad i'm still gonna go get another job in the future and then go off and travel again what i'm doing now is i'm breaking the cycle of human habit and I just started doing this because I start working next week. I've been in training these past couple of days, but I start working next week. I think 
that it's so important for anyone that wants to make progress developing their life and their ideals to break the habit of human cycle. Break the cycle of human habit, I mean. See, it's such a habit. That was not a problem. That was not a habit. That was me just speaking. But y'all get what I mean. We got to break the habits so that we can replace them with more productive things and not fall into the same common pitfalls that we do every single year because we have so much more in our control if we're willing to put the energy and the effort into thinking and planning for our decisions. Anyway, everyone, that's the video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Smash that like button. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.